Or maybe you just saw the belly of that, the portly grandpa that shows up at every meeting. How does this help? It reminds you that you have more in your life than just your current situation. You have more in your life than just the shackles and chains around you. You have more in your life than the dungeon and the smelly old guard that has changed you could care less about you. If you, as a follower of Jesus, have invested in building relationships and community and family, investing in them, then you have a community of people around you. And listen to this. When you have a community of people around you who believe in you and who love you and you call them to mind in prayers with joy, you take that minus the speediness of your current situation, Paul says, you will discover that it will equal joy on your ledger. If you were to practice that today, this first principle, who would you call to mind? And what would you say to God about that? I did it this week, and I can't even tell you how long the list was. It was incredible. For, I just gave you a couple. I thank God for my wife, who still loves me after all these years, discovering almost every bad thing about me, and still wanting to do this. I thank God for Max, for calling me up one day, almost four years ago, and inviting me to come and partner with him in this incredible church to proclaim the gospel. You know how much joy I had to me? I thank God for my four children. I really do. And, and this may not be your situation right now, but if you're a parent, you'll understand why I'm saying this about my situation. Right now, all four of my grown children are currently making good choices. That's incredible! I'm not saying it will always be that way, and I know it may not be your situation right now, but it's mine. And when I call them to name, and I think of the choices they're making, man, my joy the monitor just goes to the oh. home. Any grandparents in the room? Ah, okay, you'll get this. Rest of you want. But when I think of my granddaughter, Ava, it doesn't matter how stressful my circumstances are, no matter how much I have on my list to get done for the day, when she runs into my house and runs into my little study and calls out my name, I know. And all I have to do is think of that. And when she comes into my office, she always says this. We, we crafted this little phrase on video. You want to meet my granddaughter? Hey, look at the screen. Well, can you me? Did you hear what she said? 